top with wild weather. Overnight, severe storm slammed the Mid-South. It's our top story here at 6. I'm John Paul. I'm Caitlin Lockerbie. Tornado warnings and watches all night, especially in parts of Arkansas. Our local storm team has been tracking them for you overnight. The downpour hitting the Memphis area as well, knocking out power. Take a look here at your screen. More than 3,600 customers are in the dark. The outages, they are reported mostly in Bartlett and northeast Memphis near Sycamore View. We can see Lakeland is heavily impacted. Areas near Arlington impacted. Orange Mound impacted. MLGW crews are currently working to get people connected again. And some of the roadways are a mess this morning, too. And the power outages are only making matters worse. Yeah, it was a scary drive into work this morning. Mm -hmm. Pretty eerie with all the lights out. Local 24 News reporter Janae Francine is in Cordova Lakeland area this morning. Janae, tell us what you're seeing out there. No, a lot of police response. You toss to me, but I'm going to step out of the way and give you all a closer look. You all can also see that the lights are flashing. Now, authorities, wow, that was kind of scary. You saw that lightning, um, but it just went back out right then. But officers are out here at the scene. You all can see that they are out of their vehicles right now since more drivers are on the roadway, and they are telling you all to treat this area as a four-way stop. You all see this officer in the center of the road. He is now telling these drivers to get onto the interstate, and he has this flashlight out so we don't want these officers to get injured either you see people might be flying through follow the officers warnings now as you all can see this is a fluid situation the power just came back on you all saw the lightning kind of spooky out here and now the power is back out but we will be giving you all detailed information throughout the morning chelsea will be keeping you updated on weather and traffic as well reporting live gina francine back to the studio